man. All the way from El Paso, Texas, to Texas City, Texas. A member of the legendary Guerrero family, his uncle Eddie. His father, Chavo Guerrero Sr., the man who invented the moonsault. with his cousin Shaw Guerrero at Ladies Night Out. One of the most legendary figures in wrestling, Chavo Guerrero. WCW, who could forget the WCW cruiserweights? They put this style of wrestling on the map here in the United States. Absolutely, those epic encounters with Juve Guerrera and the likes of Rey Mysterio Jr. Eddie Guerrero, Dean Malenko, Chris Jericho, La Parca, the list goes on and on of the most incredible athletes well, there goes the, the juice is loose, Matt Topolsky. The juice is loose. But there's something to be said about generational wrestlers. And Chavo Guerrero is a third generation athlete. Wrestling is literally in his blood, going all the way back to his grandfather, Gory Guerrero, who used to promote wrestling in El Paso, Texas. Who could forget Los Guerreros in WWE, where Chavo Guerrero and his uncle, Eddie Guerrero, won the WWE Tag Team Championships. 
Chavo Guerrero was an ECW champion. He was the cruiserweight champion in both WCW and WWE. I mean, <laughs> their resumes speak for themselves. I could go on and on all night about the accomplishments of both men that we're watching in the ring. Absolutely. What a special exhibition this is at Summer of Champions. And these two incredible, legendary athletes. Hold on. Both with a combined almost four decades of experience just between the two of them, setting the table still for what is yet to come. The reality of wrestling championship in our main event. Chavo Guerrero. Like we said, might be a homecoming of sorts here to Texas. Has been living in Los Angeles, California for the past several years, competing on Lucha Underground. Oh, and a thumb to the eye. Also assisting with the gorgeous ladies of wrestling, Glow, one of the most popular television shows oh, in the country right now. At the very top of the match, a handshake and a nod from both of these competitors. But as this match continues on, Oh, you can tell that pride is the ultimate thing on the oh, line. Absolutely, in many respects, it's also like a sibling oh. rivalry. I mean, think about it. It's a rare occasion when these two get together and square off inside that squared circle. Bragging rights definitely on the table here. Perhaps it may be the last time these two ever encounter each other in a wrestling ring. Aztec war as Booker T. Oh, wait, hold on. The juice. And now taking off his mask, the mask of the luchador. A long, century-long tradition in Mexico. And now with Juventud Guerrero has unmasked himself, you can tell this is more than just a wrestling exhibition. forearms to the temple of Chavo Guerrero. Oh, well, Juventud we Guerrero taking it a bit personally here now. Uh oh. And these two men, some European style uppercuts from Chavo Guerrero to Juventud Guerrero. So here, tilt the world, hand oh. scissors take over. Oh, and now Juve the Juice is getting loose. Oh. Double knees to the back of the dome of Chavo Guerrero. As both these men are on the outside, the juice sends Chavo into the stairs. Like I told you, Matt Dabolski, the longer this match goes on, the well, more and more well, you these two throw fight that it out. handshake out the window that we saw at the beginning of this matchup. Oh, absolutely. Chavo, who'll be back in the ring cover here. One, and a kick out after two. Ladies and gentlemen, still to come. If you can believe it, we still have more action after this, our main event for the Reality of Wrestling Championship, Gino versus Rex Andrews. A championship match. More than seven years in the making. And let's think about what we've seen so far here tonight. We've crowned new Reality of Wrestling Tag Team Champions. We've crowned a brand new Reality of Wrestling Texas Champion. We now have a number one contender for that title. And Van Harrison captured the Reality of Wrestling Television Oh, wait a minute! As well. Looking for that roll through there. And then a kick to the dome from the Juice. Well, Juventud. I think has been getting the better of Chavo Guerrero throughout this entire match. Chavo Guerrero has not been able to have any sort of sustained offense. It's been all Hoovy. 
Irish whip into oh. the corner. Follows it up with a running lariat. Coming back here. Oh, Stinger splash. Missed by Hunt. Missed by Chavo Guerrero. Looking for an Alabama slam. Juice rolls through. Come on. Here. One, two. Kick Hold out. On. Rolls through again. Cover here. Two. Rolls through again. Reversal. Cover. Another reversal and another cover. from both of these two in this co-main event here at Summer. One of the most memorable nights so far. Oh. Seeing things that I never thought that we would see. And it just continues with these two. Like I said, we had Chavo Guerrero on heated conversations and Booker T and I spoke to him. And he said, there was always a little bad blood between the Guerreros and the Guerreras. One family always thought they were better than the next. And a high elbow drop off the top rope. And Hoovy looks like he's gonna try to end it right here. A reversal from Chavo. Into a suplex. Wait a minute. He's looking for 